Yes, boys, what is up? And welcome back to another episode of the Dream Chasers career mode on FIFA 23. This could be, boys, the season finale of season three. On the screen right now, you can see the league table. We are sat just outside of the playoff spots. We've got four games left in this season, which we're going to complete in this episode. Will we get into the playoffs? Will we get automatic promotion? It's still all to play for. As you can see, there is only 11 points separating P7 and P1 in this league right now. So it's going to be crazy. Stay tuned to the end of the video to see how we end the season if you are new to the channel hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you never miss an upload when i drop youtube has been really weird recently um i checked it out the other day on my channel and it wasn't showing some episodes on my channel um so if you've missed an episode make sure you check out the playlist to make sure that you're up to date um yeah it was really weird on my phone it was showing the videos but then on my desktop it wasn't showing some of the episodes so if you have missed an episode make sure you go back and check them out this is part three of the playoff push which we are going for um, obviously the last few episodes have been called the playoff push and we are pushing still for those playoffs a win against Sheffield Wednesday would put us into the playoff spots as long as somebody above us drops points which would be absolutely huge as we can see we've got Nottingham Forest and QPR tied on 77 points there a win here could even put us above Norwich and right back in contention. This season is crazy how close it is and I can't wait to see how it finishes. Can we win all of our remaining games and get into the Premier League, boys? Let's find out. Without further ado, let's jump straight into the first game of the episode against Sheffield Wednesday. They are nowhere to be seen, down on 57 points. So let's jump into it. Hopefully we have more luck than that last game um, against Swansea because that was a really tough game. Everyone's on full fitness though. We've got our full strength squad out. Messi down to 83 overall despite just winning the World Cup this past weekend, uh, but we've got a World Cup winner in our side. Abamyang's dropped the rating as well down to 78. But can we finish the season strong? Let's find out, boys. Let's get it. The pre match chatter about Pierre Emerick Abamyang in imperious form and the leading marksman in the league. Can he add to his total today on EA TV? He might be losing overall, but he's still a top scorer in the league. 27 goals in 41 games, I want to say. Let's jump into it. It's a home game at Heaven's Arena. Can we put on a show for the fans? We need to bring, we need to bring our A game this episode because it's really the desire for what's going to happen next season. Let's get it, boys. No way! Oh, boys, it's, it's the worst possible start to the episode. I knew it was going to happen. The sixth minute as well. It's classic RDC world, but... We've not even had a touch of the ball yet. We've conceded already. Oh, lad, I just knew that was going to happen. Here is the World Cup winner, Messi. Can he make something happen? Best player in the team is Aubameyang. Into Elliot. Aubameyang, he's going to take it himself. He plays it through to the World Cup winner. And he's made the keeper. That is terrible goalkeeping. But there he is. Leo Messi, undisputed goat of this sport. And we are level Get in, boys. That was so weird. Abamyang just wouldn't speed up there. And Messi, that was a weird shot. Everything's weird about this game. But we're back in it. Come on. Oh, what a tackle that is for Mina. That is absolutely crucial. Mina stepped up defensively these last few games so much. Well, in Canales, big interception. Counter again. Hashimoto playing the ball forward. Abamyang. We've got Messi on the overlap again. Inside, we've got Messi. We've got Messi. We've got Messi. Oh, the save. He should have took that with his left foot, bro. Hashimoto wins it, though. It's still alive. It's still alive into Lee. It's Hashimoto at the near post. Big block. Big block, Nicholas. Come on, everyone's stepping up, boys. We are motivated to try and get this automatic promotion. Possibly the league title. Is Elliot playing through Lee. It's a great ball. I see Aubameyang at the back post. We don't have the space to get it there, though. Lee, he's still got it. Alive. Messi. Hashimoto. Yuto. Big block. Rebage into Hashimoto again. Hashimoto into Aubameyang. A great goal. Come on. Hashimoto Yuto on the assist. My favorite player in the team. Let's go, boys. Aubameyang on the score sheet again. What's that? 28 goals now in this season. Ridiculous player. Abama who? Abama what? Abama blood Clark Yang. Look at that for a pass. Oh, fancy. And a great finish from Aubameyang. Let's go. Here's Lee. Great pass into Elliot. Oh, that's a great pass into Elliot. And we're playing through Messi. Can he get the shot off? Messi, what a save from the keeper. We need that comfort goal now, boys. We're all over these. All over them. Oh, I've left the inside exposed there, Canales. Can you get there? Hashimoto's done so much running there. Canales, get there. Big save, King. Get it out, Mina. 
Well in. Oh, he's kept it in play as well. Well played, boys. What a touch from Messi as well. Hashimoto. Play that ball. Play that ball. It's the GOAT. Inside is Elliot. Inside is Aubameyang. Can I beat the defender? We have done. Can we beat the keeper? We can do. Oh, Obama blood clot Yang. He's so good. Let's go, boys. Perfect start to the episode. Come on. We need this. We need these points. Come on. Oh, Hashimoto. What a player. Elliot looking to play for Aubameyang. He's on for a hat-trick here, Aubameyang. He's going to hold it up, though. Plays into Hashimoto. Another fancy pass into Messi. Back into him. Hashimoto outside the foot. What a strike and a great save from the keeper again. All right, it's crunch time in the season, boys. So I'm going to make some uh, subs now that we do have um, this advantage and this lead. So we're going to bring on um, Reggie Field. Bamiyang, he wants that hat trick, but we are taking him off um, regardless. And I'm going to take off Elliot as well. Just try and save stamina. I don't know how close our games are um, or whatnot, but I'm just going to try and preserve people's fitness regardless of that. Is Canales on the edge of the box? Big save from the keeper. <laughs> Great win, boys. Can we keep this momentum in the last three games of the season? And has that three points moved us up in the table? Let's find out. We actually had a long time between games there. We've got our monthly scout report back. Um, Dylan Simmons, I don't even remember signing this guy to the Youth Academy, but his potential stinks. So let's release him straight away. Billy Cairns, though. Oh, my God. Look at that potential. 89 to 94. That's insane, bro. And I think the CDM training is finished. Oh, no, it's not. I don't know why it said that. It looked like the CDM training was finished. 21 weeks still. But... Boys, this guy's insane, bro. What the hell? 89 to 94 potential. This guy is an absolute star. Those stats, he can play anywhere on the pitch. Literally, he's going to be the rude hullet of this team. Daniel Greenwood, his potential stinks a little bit. We might just sign him and sell him on. Um, Arthur Jones as well. Uh, Matsuda Kenji, Fujiwara, not looking great. Daniel Giles, though, great potential there too. And Nishimura Takaya, not looking great. But Billy Keynes is definitely the star man for next season to look at. Wow. And here is the league table. We are still in seventh. We've got a game in hand now um, on a few people above us. It's only Nottingham um, who we actually play next. That's huge. We play Nottingham Forest next. And if we win, we will overtake them and move back into the playoff spots. Three points here again is absolutely crucial. Let's jump into it. It's against a top five team, Nottingham Forest. They've got even higher goal difference than us, Nottingham as well. Even though our goal difference is 29, theirs is 33. They've scored an insane amount and conceded less, way less than us as well. Nearly 20 goals less. But let's jump in against Nottingham Forest. One of the biggest games of the season. And we do need clean sheets and away games still for a manager objective. Let's jump in. Oh, bro, look at that. Mitrovic, Martinez, Gibbs, White, Otamendi. What the hell is, that? is this team, bro? Let's jump into it. A proverbial six-pointer in the race for promotion. A win today would be massive in terms of who does go up. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. To be honest with you boys, I really don't even want it to be in the playoffs because the playoffs just sound scary. I want that automatic promotion. To do that though, we need to win our three remaining games. Can we win this one against Nottingham? My name is Derek Ray and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United. Here's Messi looking to beat a few men off the ball. And we're on the cusp of bringing you live action from one of the most exciting leagues in Europe, the Championship. This is a quick start from the lads. What are you expecting to see? Thanks, Derek. Big star from the lads. Aubameyang get that shot off early. Big save. Come on. We're showing Nottingham what type of energy we're on. Early on in this game. Oh my god, Gibbs White. What a pass that is. He is ridiculously good. I wonder what Martinez that is up front. It's the one from Atalanta. I'm on to him. He's, he's rapid, bro. Yo, they've got Mitrovic and... Um, I can't even remember his name, his first name, but that's an insane striker duo. Oh... With Gibbs White in a canvas behind them, that's danger. That literally spells danger. Flying fullback coming forward there as well, Mina. Hashimoto, what a challenge. This Bro, this guy is an absolute hero. Go on, Messi. Got some space down the wing. Inside. Abamyang, look at the space. Elliot, get that touch. What a turn. Go on, Elliot. Get the shot off near post. Big save. We couldn't go across goal there. Would have got blocked. Oh, what a start to this game. Ah, oh, boys, this feels like foot champions. I feel like I'm literally, like, trying my hardest. I'm proper sweating playing the computer here. Oh, Theon, huge block. Referee. Oi. Nice switch, Hashimoto. 
Space seems to be out wide with Messi. I don't know why they're giving the best player in the world all this space. Here's Theon linking up with Lee. He's got him. Can we get that ball inside to Aubameyang? We found him. Hashimoto's there. Hashimoto's there. Hashimoto's there. Big save. Rebound, Messi. Keep it in. It's alive. Rebage. Hashimoto again. Big turn. Oh, big tackle. Gibbs White. What a player. We might need to look at San him ourselves, you know, because he's insane. No! Big save, King. Oh, Gibbs White is an absolute danger on the ball, mate. Nothing. I've got a great squad here, you know. No wonder they've scored so many goals. So back underway, and an intriguing second well, in Hashimoto. There's a reason we've scored more, though. Messi inside. Abamyang, Hashimoto, Yuto, yes, come on, come on, Hashimoto, Yuto, my guy, let's go boys, oh, what a goal that is as well, Abamyang, look at the run into the box, I love the centre mid, box to box style player, that'll make those forward runs, is also class and defence, what a guy, Hashimoto, Yuto, oh, his potential and his overall has not been going up as quick as I thought it would have, but he still has potential to be special, it says, in the squad hub, which means 90+. plus. This guy's going to be a menace when he's 90-rated, bro. Canales, absolute beast. Look at that. He's an animal. He is an animal. Here's Aubameyang getting it out wide. Hashimoto. Oh, he's so good. Messi wants it to feet. Messi, can he go on a run with it? The GOAT. Look at the space we've got. Elliot's inside. Elliot's inside. Go on, Elliot. Oh, big save. Oh, that's poor from them. Hashimoto, man of the match so far. He's got it again. Big shot. And again, he's got it. Playing through Rabiger. He's looking to slide one through to Morgan Elliott. And it's gone in. It's 2-0. Come on, boys. This is perfect. Let's go. Let's go. We need to hold on to this now. Let's hold on to this. Hashimoto Yuto again. Absolute catalyst in the midfield. What a guy. Big block. And again, boys. And again, boys. Oh, Gibbs White. Gibbs White. Get to it. Get to it. Get it out. Oh, boys, we're defending with our lives on the line here. Looks like Nottingham's changed the formation here. Gibbs White is out on the wing now. What can he do out here against my man Mina? Oh, he's beaten for pacing behind. Can we defend that ball? Canales, get it out. That might be the last chance. Nottingham get. Oh, Raber just committed. Well in, Raber Jack. Come on, get it out. Blow the whistle, ref. Come on, boys. That's absolutely huge. We've beat the team that was above us in the league. Took three points away from them and got that away clean sheet. Oh, let's go. What a performance from Hashimoto Yuto, though. All credit has to go to him. Absolutely sensational player. Let's go. Here's how the league looks after that game. We're into fourth place, boys. Into fourth place with a game in hand on the three guys in front of us. And if we win that game, we will overtake QPR and get into those guaranteed automatic promotion spots. Wow. We really need to we really need to win this next game. It's against Luton Town. Let's see where they are in the league. Not that it matters. They're in 18th. I always struggle against the lower teams in the league. But if we beat Luton Town, we move up into second place. That's absolutely huge. There's two games left in the league. This is huge. We've got a 32 million pound transfer offer for our right back, Mina who is 20 years old and 78. Mina is going nowhere. What a player he is. That's a massive transfer offer, though. Could look to sell him next season, possibly. Who knows where we'll end up. But, boys, if we win this game, we move up in second. That's absolutely massive against Luton Town. Let's get it. Everyone have full fitness still? Let's jump into it, man. Let's keep this form going. Keep the momentum pushing. Yeah, we keep pushing. Real dreams change the world. Let's go. Hashimoto, he, oh, what a player. I, I need to stop saying it. You just need to appreciate his class. 
Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great Theon, stepping up. Now is crunch time in the season. It's time to step up. And he is stepping up. Here's Elliot looking into that space. Messi inside. Rabiger. One more inside. Sweaty goal. Get your tits out. Obama Young. What a goal. Five minutes into the game. It's RDC style. Obama who? Obama what? Obama blood clot Young. Let's go, boys. Come on. We're on our way to the Premier League. Let's get it. What a goal, lad. Is everyone involved there? Such lovely play. Rabiger, that touch and the pass inside. Shouts like KSI. Sweaty goals. You know about them ones. Aubameyang, I see Lee making that run, he put his hand up, he wanted it, across the box, nobody there, somebody is there though, Hashimoto, what a turn, what a touch, oh, what a player he is, lad, I said I'd stop mentioning it, but what a player he is really growing into, mate, the guy can do everything, bro, the guy can do everything, he can defend, he can attack, he can pass, he can dribble the ball, what an absolute star. Yeah, we talk about the blue lock. I wanted a striker to come out of our blue lock project. But we don't even need a striker. This is the real star of the blue lock right here. Hashimoto Yuto. Yeah, that's our Isagi. He's awakened that monster inside him, bro. And we are absolutely flying now. Come on. In a must-win game as well. We're 2-0 up after 10 minutes. What a game. James Bree. Think you can be Canales in the air? Don't think so, pal. Elliot into Messi. Down the wing, Messi. And Cara Messi. Look at that for a pass. Oh my god, if that went to Aubameyang, that would have been gorgeous, bro. Oh, and that's why we kept Mina. That's why we don't sell Mina. Oh, maybe we should sell him. <laughs> no, that's why we keep Mina. That is why we're not selling him. What a player. Now we've got the pace there. Left back is out of position. Oh, look at the dribbling as well. Look at the dribbling from the lad. He's still got it. Into Aubameyang. Overlap. Rebiger. Overlap again. Someone. We've got numbers forward. Oh, we've just... We're over... Like, literally bombarding them, bro. With these numbers going forward. Rabiger and Hashimoto. In that centre mid, box to box, like, double up roll. Again, Mina quality. Our centre mids, honestly, carry this team. This formation, I'm loving it. I didn't like it at first, but... We've really, like, gelled with this formation. Oh, that's great play. That's just sensational. It just is sensational. We're ready for the Prem, boys. The last few episodes have been tough. We've been through some tough times this season. You get me? There was times when I doubted it, but real dreams changed the world. That's what the RDC stands for. You get me? Real dream chasers, bro. Look at this. Rabiger, calm, collected, into Elliot, assist leader. Yeah? Assist leader into Obama blood cloth. Who? Obama blood cloth. Who? Yeah? <laughs> oh, what a finish. Let's go. Keepers, Tony King, one of his last games for the club, uh, probably, because we're going to replace him next season, but he's been a great servant for the club. Here he is, called into action again after a mistake from me, and he's made the save. Come on, everyone's just pulling through. These last four games, the lads knew what we needed to do, and they're pulling through with it right now. Referee! Referee! That's a red card. I'm trying to injure Rabiger before our final game of the season. I don't think so. All right, boys. Half time here with 3-0 up. I don't want to take it, like, for granted. But our next game in the league after this one is against Stoke City. And it's in, like, two days' time. So I am concerned about the fitness of people. Hashimoto looking tired already. He's been immense these last few games. So Modric is going to come on at half time there. Um, I'm actually going to play Lee in Cam. Elliot's going to drop to the bench. Uh, Tommy Bailey can come on on the wing. We'll even Messi on for now and Aubameyang just in case we need another goal. But then we've got Duarte and Field off the bench to come on a bit later if we need to. Um, and yeah, that's it for now. But I do want to like keep an eye on fitness. Rabiger looking a bit tired as well. We might have to bring on Naylor soon for him. There's Lee in behind Aubameyang. He wants another goal. Can he get it? He can. And that's perfect. Now it's four. Let's make those other subs. We don't need these guys on. Rabage and Knackered. Bring on Naylor there. Aubameyang off for Lee. Uh, and Messi off for Duarte. Great win there, boys. 4-0. It was a must-win game. And we've boosted up our goal difference too. Now with that, we should be in second place in the league if my maths is correct. Let's check it. And it is, boys. We're in second place. Tied on points with QPR in third. One point ahead of Nottingham and Southampton, who are tied on points. And Norwich are only three points behind. So it's literally going to come down to the very final game of this season. This is going to be insane. This really is going to be insane, boys. Final game of the season to decide who goes up and who remains in the playoffs. 
Watford have run away with the title there and won the league though, so shout out to them. But it's all to play for for that second place automatic promotion. Let's find out who's going to get it. We need a lot of things to go our way if we are to drop points here against Stoke City. Let's see where Stoke are in the league, just for the sake of it. They're in 13th place, a goal difference of 5. They've only scored 65 and conceded 60. Conceding 60 is very nice to see, especially when we've scored 97 goals this season. But then we've conceded 62 ourselves. So, who's going to come out on top? Our good attack or their bad defence? <laughs> Let's find out. Like I say, we can't afford to drop points regardless here. It's a must-win game. One more push, boys. One more push. We only have three days between the games there. People looking okay-ish for stamina. It's only Lee that looks a bit tired. Those early subs in the last game really helped the boys recover for this one. It is one final push. Let's get into it. Well, for the fans as well as for the players, it is all about promotion. That's what's on the line. And if things go their way, they'll be celebrating at the end of this match. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. It's a big one, boys. Biggest game of our lives so far, probably this one, even though we played against Man United last season, which was a huge game. But this, it means a lot more than that one. A lot more at stake. It's promotion or playoffs. What's it going to be? Rabiger, fantastic player. Fantastic. Starting us off right in this game here. Big players step up in big games. What can the GOAT do for us here? He's get the ball into Elliot. We've got a lot of space to work with. Looking back for the GOAT. The GOAT steps up in big games. That's what I'm talking about. That's why he's the GOAT. The GOAT. Let's go. That is why he is the GOAT. Look at that space and a great pass from Elliot in behind. Oh, that is why he's the GOAT. Oh, bro. Let's go, boys. Oh, the keeper should do better. It, was, it wasn't even a good shot from Messi. But, oh, what a start to the game. In a must-win game, an early goal like that is absolutely massive. In the ninth minute, and Messi's got two nines on his back as well. Yo, it was meant to be, bro. Lee. Great ball. Great ball into Fita Bamiyang. We've got some space here to work with. Stoke City defence all over the place. Back into Aubameyang. Can we get the touch and the shot? He's just a bit too slow now, Aubameyang. His little tiny adjustments like that are just not good enough. But this is, of course, Aubameyang's last game with us as Theo makes a brilliant tackle. This is Aubameyang's last game with us because uh, he is going to retire after this season. Luka Modric also... Well, it might be his last game if we win it. Um, otherwise, we'll have the playoffs. But just a quick announcement if that is the case. If we do win this one, uh, Modric obviously retiring this season. And so is Aubameyang. James Milner possibly retiring. Uh, I'm not too sure on him yet. Great touch, Rebiger. Come on, look at the strength. Look at the strength. Playing through Hashimoto. Can we get two? Hashimoto, big save. Um, yeah, so we're losing Aubameyang. We're losing um, Modric. We are also going to lose Tony King because we are going to replace him for next season. So it's his last game too. Aubameyang! Oh! <laughs> Speak of the devil! He's going and he's going out with a bang. Abama who? Abama what? Abama blood clot, Yang. It might be the last time I get to say that, but what a goal to go out on. I was just about to say as well, boys, after this season's finished, I wanted to put a compilation together of the best goals of the season and let you vote for the best. But that is definitely going to be up there if I do make that compilation. What a goal that is. Abama who? Abama what? Say it with me for one of the last times. Abama blood clot, Yang. What a finish that is, lad. We haven't scored from a corner all season. And when we do, it's an overhead kick into the side net. And that's ridiculous. Let's go. Elliot. Elliot down the line. Linking up with Lee. The two Morgans. The two Morgans. Here's Morgan Lee. Great dribble and pen ref. He stayed on his feet. Morgan Lee. He doesn't go down easy. What a strike. What a save. Can we have another one, Aubameyang? Can we have a repeat? Oh, we almost did. What? Lad Aubameyang. Oh, bro. He knows that this is his last game and he wants to just... Go on, Aubameyang. Oh, he's gone again. <laughs> Yo. Oh, he's having fun with it. He knows this might be his last game in playing football ever. And, oh, Hashimoto. Hashimoto. Oh. Yeah, bro. Oh, the Bam Yankees having fun with it. I'm having fun with it. Everyone's having fun with it. Hashimoto. Insane. Oh, that was Elliot. But, yo, what a game this has been. What a half. We've got, what, 45 minutes left, boys, before we find out where we're playing next season. Is it going to be the Premier League or are we still here? And the second half is underway. Oh, Messi. Oh, lad, I'm just playing with it now. I'm literally just playing with it. 
Bamiyang into Hashimoto. Look at this link up play. Look at this link up play. Look at this link up play. Across the box. Oh, Lee was there for a tap in. A Bamiyang is though. And Elliot off the post and in. It's three. Come on. Surely we can't let this slip. Saying that as a Liverpool fan, surely we can't let this slip now. Come on, Stoke have not even threatened us once. I don't even think they've had a shot this game. Just hold out, boys. Oh, what a finish that is, Rabage. I did not even expect that to go in. Oh, boys, that's the cherry on top of the cake. What a finish that is, Rabage. Let's see the replay. It's Theon on the assist. I thought, you know, I've got a bit of space. Let's just see if he can curl it. Didn't even know Rabage had, had that in his locker. At least we know now. 4-0. That's a great goal difference as well if it comes down to it, but I think we're flying anyway. Oh, what a pass that is from Tommy Bailey. The fans are on the feet. Aubameyang, is he going to go for another goal? No, he's not. He's taking it to the corner. He's seeing out the season. And there is the full-time whistle, boys. We're through. We're... Oh, my God. We've done it. Well, We've done it. We're in the Premier League. Messi drops to his knees. The absolute goat. Oh, boys, that is well deserved. What a season. What a season, mate. Wow. I can't believe it, bro. Oh, the title we couldn't get. We couldn't get that three peats back to back to back uh, titles. But automatic promotion, regardless. We don't have to go through the stress and the hassle of the playoffs. The lads, oh, every one of them deserves this, bro. We deserve this. All the fans watching, the crowd watching on YouTube, we deserve this, bro. It's Premier League football next season. I thought there might have been more celebrations than that. Are you really going to just skip it like that, EA? I was soaking in the glory there. But, ah, oh, get in, boys. What a win that was then. One shot from Stoke, just completely outclassing the whole game. And yeah, we're through to the Premier League, bro. Hello, Reds. What a win that was then. When we started this career mode, I called it Dream Chases, and I said the dream was winning the Premier League. We get 8.4 million prize money for coming second. Let's just confirm that by looking at the standings. We do finish second in the league. 87 points tied with QPR in third place, and we just win it on goal difference. 101 goals for, but we conceded 62. Next season, we really need to work on the defence. Look at that. We conceded 20 more goals than the team above and below us. Uh, we conceded the most goals in the top like nine in the top 10 <laughs> conceded the most goals in the top 10 still came second 101 goals for is insane boys next episode i will do like an end of season breakdown just to give it a bit of a break before we get back into um games for next season i'll go through the squad report the goals the assists it probably possibly might have that compilation of best goal which you can vote for in the comments and um, if you remember any good goals from this season drop them in the comments so i can go and find the clips for them to include them in that episode makes the editing easier for me but with that being said we will end the season properly in the next episode and possibly start the premier league in the next episode who knows we'll have to find out there but boys we are through to the premier league season three is at its final stint and yeah man i appreciate everyone's support through this season hopefully has continued to support the team in the premier league it's going to be tough because this championship season was tough 25 wins 11 draws and nine losses yeah nine it's that the nine bro it's written in the nine i'm telling you 39 goal difference as well absolutely insane but bro what a season it's been i appreciate everyone's support like comment share and subscribe don't go anywhere because we're coming back in the premier league big signings next season big games big clubs big everything you get me big women but <laughs> hey like comment share subscribe you know the vibes boys i'll catch you next time take it easy